Yo, 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 my people, we've been working on our Bloxburg Cottagecore town that we're going to be using for a roleplay series coming up. And we are on our eighth building or like little section. So today we're going to be working on this one right here. And it is going to be a little coffee shop slash bakery. And yeah, there's like three different sections I see to this, but let's just go into build mode and get started. Just look at this town. So full. Oh my goodness. And we'll just have one more plot left after today. I was playing around with this last night to figure out what I wanted to do for this little bakery slash coffee shop. It's really going to be like a stand versus like an actual store. Now, where's that thing that I need? So the first part of this is this little workbench. So we're going to put this right here. And then I'm going to use the rustic console tables. Where are you? There you be. Now it's going to go right there for the first one. And then this one is going to go right here and make a bit of a corner. And then we need some pillars, these plain thin pillars. For the roof, I'm going to use a basic shape, but I'm going to need a roof first in the basement, a flat roof. So we're just going to do a little of this, a little of this, raising it right up to flat with the pillars. Oop. And then we're going to get a carpet. Put that right over here. And then we get to our basic shape finally and get this horizontal wedge. We are just going to put you smack dab in the middle facing this way and we'll resize you. And then I'm just going to go ahead and delete this roof and the carpet and hope that that looks good. It does not. It is too long. One eternity later. I can't quite figure out these pillars, but I'm going to just be happy with this because I don't want to mess with that. Oh, it looks so bad over here. Never mind. <laughs> One eternity later. Okay, it's not perfect, but I finally got it, y'all. So this is like the base of it. I have a feeling we might need to add counters, but I'm not absolutely sure. I did already add some of these hanging planters last night. So I kind of just want to do that again because it was really cute and I don't want to like forget that. And then I also added a few of my favorite plants. <laughs> so we'll just put a few of these here, which I love them, but it's also to hide the fact that these are technically, they're like hanging from nothing. <laughs> Nobody needs to see that or know that it's not happening see it's already so cute don't you think so that's kind of the basics for the actual stand there may be some differences when i actually get to work on it more but then over here i was just hoping to have like a little like seating area with like a gazebo so i definitely want to put that traditional gazebo somewhere over here maybe like that and one of y'all katoko utsugi shout out to you asked me to build a bird place in the town so i'm gonna add it in here that's gonna be the third and final thing you said can you build a bird place in your Bloxburg town like a few bird houses a bird bath and dirt piles with the dotty slash dirt material and wheat color for seeds plastic birds etc just an idea to make it I'll have to read the rest of what that comment was later but you get the general gist of what you were asking for let me just like I'm gonna just place down a few of those things <laughs> let's see where are those bird houses there they are oh I don't know how many I want to do probably a lot but I'll just put down a few know that I'm gonna do a lot of work on this so I'm just like getting the idea out there putting the things you said so i don't forget a bird bath yes here that is bam i wish we could resize that i don't think we can it just seems so small and then some of these bird statues we'll put a few in here yeah i hope i can make this majestic and looking real nice but this is like <laughs> the very basic idea of this section i will see you when it's all complete and beautified okay y'all are you ready for the final tour the final result well, here it is. So let me see. Let me go into free cam mode so I can just show you the exterior. So over here, we have our little seating area, a little gazebo over here. And then we have the actual little bakery stand. And then I built in this part, which is actually the bakery where the baking happens. And that's our little sign right there. As you can see, if we go out here, it's called Blush Cafe. It's a little hard to read. Just imagine some baked goods like sitting on that little crafting table or whatever that's called. And then over here, we have a little hammock area. And then this over here is our little like bird sanctuary. So we have some bird houses, a tree, a bird bath, some like seeds on the ground <laughs> and the birds like eating the seeds and whatnot and just hanging around living their birdie lives. <laughs> Hope you all enjoyed enjoyed this video. If you did, please consider liking, commenting, and subscribing because it's free and we would love to have you here in this awesome community. I will see you next time. Bye!